Yo, Glint Gang, it's Glint, and I'm back with another video. We on a voiceover tip because I don't talk that much in the gym. Bro, do you hear how squeaky this machine is? I'm about to grab some WD 40. This is ridiculous. But yeah, we in this thing hitting back and bars. Um, back and shoulders is actually my favorite muscle groups to work out. But I can't remember if I did any shoulders in this video or not. So check it out. If you feeling the vibes, even if you're not feeling the vibes, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Um, hit the bell for post notifications. Hey, listen, I'm new to this. Well, I'm not really new to this gym life, but this is the most consistent I've been in a long time. So help me out. Let me know what I need to be doing. Let me know what I need to be eating. Let me know how I can better myself in the gym. Um, I have a weight goal that we'll talk about in another video, but definitely lock it in with me and become, become a part of my community. It's going to be a fun journey. Hey, so for all you gym heads out here, I got a quick question. When I'm doing these pull downs, should the bar be in front of my face or should they be behind me? Because sometimes I'll put it like right under my, right above my chest when I pull down. Let me know. This is LA Fitness in Philly. Um, that's where I'm at currently. But I'm gonna be honest with y'all. I'm actually thinking about leaving LA. I need to find um, another gym, a different gym with better equipment and a nice variation of equipment. There are there are different muscle groups that uh, I want to target and focus on. And I'm gonna be honest. I'm a big guy, but I want to be cut like a bag of dope. That's just me being transparent. That's me just being honest. Um, I'm currently in school, so. Soon, I'm gonna be looking for a new home gym. I'm gonna be looking for a new home gym. LA Fitness just ain't cutting it no more. Now, do they have a lot of weights and stuff? Of course, but the machines, like I'm starting to plateau. I feel like I'm doing the same thing over and over again. Of course, I could do like CrossFit and, and body weight type stuff, but currently I'm at 305, I believe, um, weight wise, and I wanna get down to 205. So that's 100 pounds of weight that I need to lose. Because I'm a, one of my major goals, and this might sound petty, this might sound uh, minuscule. I want a six pack. It's, I haven't had a six pack in years, in years. So I really want a six pack, and I'm going to get it. Um, obviously, 80% nutrition, 20% gym. Um, but yeah, I'm after it. So take this journey with me, man. Take this journey. Become a part of the community. And um, I'll probably do a gym tour, um, different gyms in Philly to see what I like. Um, I wouldn't mind having an iron gym because um, my goal is to hit the weights for one session and then come back later in the day or later in the night to do cardio. Um, but I don't, you know, I'm, I'm knowledgeable, but I don't know everything. And that's what I am, a student of life. So I want to know everything that's going to put me in position to not only be cut like a bag of dope, but also um, have a six pack. I want a six pack. <laughs> uh, I sound like a child, but I, that's what I want. You know what I mean? And I want a big chest. I want my chest to poke out like, you know, like like a bodybuilder. So um, shit. if you're watching in the comments, let me know what's your favorite muscle group to work out. Let me know what your goals are and uh, we can take this journey together. So in a, a minute or so, um, it's gonna switch to um, like the next day I came into the gym and I think I'll be hitting legs. Um, but right now I'll be in the gym at about five o'clock a.m., 5.15 in the morning. I usually start my days at 3 a.m. But for the last week or so, I've been waking up at 1.30, two o'clock. Yeah, of course. That's all that matters. 
shout out to the homie um that's one of the guys that i have seen here for years um i used to hoop with them and with him but um i have a like a chronic ankle injury from my time in the army so i can get on the court but it's not to go as hard as i did when i was a teenager in mid-20s um i feel blessed like god has really been moving in my life and just completely taking control of any stress any anything you know what i'm saying so hey you too don't do me don't do me dirty for the music it's in, i'm in the gym bro i owe y'all the biggest apology I just knew that this angle was going to be fire. I thought I was being innovative and creative, but but if I would have moved my hat, y'all probably could see, you know, the work that's being done to the chest area. I'm highly disappointed in myself. I am so sorry. If y'all can find it in your heart to forgive, I, I'd highly appreciate it because I messed up this camera angle heavy. Hear me out though. I don't think the camera angle is bad. I just think the camera is just too close to me. If I could, you know, lift it up a little higher and let it tower over me like that, it'd be perfect. But yeah, epic fail. Big epic fail. Um, maybe put the hat back. I'm gonna try it again. I'm gonna try it again. And, you know, we'll see. We'll see. What you're thinking why is he doing a leg workout i mean why did he just do a chest workout or a chest exercise and then go back to legs because i don't have no common sense y'all i don't have no common sense sometimes i throw in a little variation out of nowhere it don't make sense it don't add up i really want to grow my chest so sometimes i'm like you know what let me go add a little bit of that, you know, even though it probably need to recover and all that because the last, the workout before this one was back. I just, you know, I think this was on a Saturday or Sunday and I just wanted to throw a little chest in there just to, you know, round it off a little bit, you know, smooth out the edges. Now these right here, this is the only squat that I can successfully do because of my bad ankle. And I ain't gonna lie. I love these goblet squats. That sounds crazy, but yeah, they're my favorite. They're my favorite. Grab a little kettlebell, a little weight. Now, if you are watching this portion of the video, you've made it to the end. All we gotta do is lift this big ass, uh, what is that? 90 and 90, 180 plus what, 45? was it 225 and you know you've made it to the end of the video and guess what i appreciate you so stay locked in with me keep liking keep commenting keep subscribing um all positivity